Hey guys, it has been seven months since I purchased my Mossberg Shockwave 590 and uh, I gotta say I have been loving it. The reason why I purchased this and the reason why many people purchase it is probably for a home defense as well as, you know, going camping. It's easy to take. It's super small. You can put it in one of the backpacks if you decide to go like on a little hike. Um, definitely nice to have peace of mind, you know, if you're camping, um, have this in your tent right next to you. I've been loving it, ran different types of ammo through it and um, had no issues, no jams, no nothing. Um, just super reliable. And um, yeah, it has the this handle right here. Um, so it gives you that extra you know, grip to hold on so it doesn't go flying out of your hand. I did purchase a few different add-ons uh, for my Mossberg. I have this grip right here, which is a must-have um, because it really helps you hold on to it because um, this thing does have a kick. It's not a horrible kick. Um, initially watching videos before I purchased this, um, some people made it seem like uh, <laughs> it was real intimidating. It actually isn't. Um, you just gotta hold on to it. But this grip definitely helps. Um, highly recommend this grip if you're thinking about getting the Mossberg 590 Shockwave. The other thing that I did get is this uh, Mesa six shot saddle right here. Um, another thing that I highly, highly recommend getting as well. Um, it's just nice to have to reload or when it's time to reload rather than running back and forth to your box. And um, it isn't loaded right now either. I forgot to mention that, but yeah, absolutely loving it. I'm gonna run a few different types of ammo through it with you guys and uh, show you how smooth and easy it is to operate if you're thinking about it. I'm loving it for how small it is. And uh, like I said, perfect for camping. I haven't taken it camping yet this year, um, but plan on going camping soon. And uh, she's coming along. So <laughs> let's have some fun. We're gonna shoot some different types of ammo. All right, guys, I have loaded some four buck into my side saddle. So we are ready to go. Now, one other thing that I did want to mention is the safety is right here um, and then red fire so I'll leave the safety on until I am ready to load so also this is a 12 gauge 14 inch barrel forgot to mention that as well um, but I think we are ready to load her up and get to shooting I do like to load my side saddle like this that way it's easy to pull out and load this way um, quick and easy for a quick reload so I'm just gonna do three of the four buck We're we're ready to go. Safety off. And safety back on, so I'm gonna go reload. All right, we are loaded up with double lots. So I'm gonna go ahead and load the chamber. And if you run a shotgun for home defense, let me know what your home defense ammo that you like to run in your shotgun is. We are ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the safety and uh, load her up and we're take down this box. All right, let me uh, reload. And for the final ammo that we are running through this, the slug, the favorite. Um, so yeah, I got three of these again. Load her up and uh, we're gonna go for it. Safety off. And a clear from last time. <laughs> Clear, safety on. So there it is, a um, few different types of ammo through it, the slug. Like I said, if you're thinking about getting one of these, this grip is like a lifesaver. When I shot this before the grip, um, when your hands get sweaty, it starts slipping. So this is a must have. Um, I'll have the links down below for the grip as well as the side saddle, which I feel is a must as well. Like I said, less going back to the box to reload. I mean, if the box is further away from you, but super, super nice. Um, I guess you can't call it a shotgun because it's not technically a shotgun, but uh, <laughs> um, super nice firearm as they call it. Um, I would highly recommend it. Like I said, perfect for home defense. It's small enough to take camping or, you know, if you go on a hike or whatnot, but definitely um, some good protection here. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give the video a like, consider subscribing, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye guys.